Hello, Assalamu Alaikum. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to make kidney bean dal. This is tin kidney beans, two tins. Onion, one chopped onion, garlic ginger paste, three green chili chopped, one tomato chopped. This is the dry spice salt, um, half a teaspoon, or according to your taste, half a teaspoon of haldi powder, that's turmeric in English. Half a teaspoon of um, dhania powder, that's coriander in English, that's chili powder and that's curry powder, that's a mixed curry powder of everything and then finish off with coriander. Here I've got frying pan with two tablespoons of sunflower oil and I'm going to start cooking. First put some onion. I'm going, to I'm going to take the lid off and then put, it's been, it's been about a minute of, so it's a medium low heat. I'm going to put garlic ginger paste, one um, tablespoon and then some chopped green chilli. Stir it well for a minute or so. Chopped tomatoes in. Cover it and leave it until the tomatoes go soft. That could be a minute. Take the lid off. Stir it for a minute or so. Wait until the tomatoes are gone soft. Okay, the onions and the tomatoes are gone soft. Now I'm going to put the spices in. Salt, turmeric, coriander, chili and curry powder. All going in together. Stir it. Right, I'm going to cook, leave it for a few min uh, minute or two so the spices get cooked. Cover it. Onion and the tomatoes and the spice are cooked. Now I'm going to add the kidney beans. So I'm going to cover it and leave it for a couple of minutes. It's been about a minute and a half. Quickly stir and leave it for another couple of minutes. Right, after two more minutes, stir it. Right, so it's fit, fit into the pan. All you do is like you have to add a glass of water to about 250 ml. I'm going to cover it and wait till it comes to the boil. Yeah. 
I'm gonna give her another stir and give her about a couple of more minutes. Remember, it doesn't take long because it's from the tin. The beans are already soft. Give her a quick stir. Right, I'm gonna use the masher. So it's uh, it's not gonna be pure, but it's gonna be roughly mashed. So all the flavor goes in. There you go. Cover it and leave it for another two three minutes. After about three more minutes, this is all done. All right, I'm gonna put Tonya in. I'm gonna give a quick stir. I just put coriander in. Give her a little mix. And off. Okay guys, so this dish is almost complete. The last stage left is a taruka. Taruka is known as an infusion. Um, this dish is vegan friendly. Uh, we're going to do a taruka with some ghee, which is unclarified butter. Which... I'm going to put the frying pan on because it's hot. Tablespoon of ghee. Wait till it heats up. Now the ghee has melted. I'm going to use one teaspoon of zira, that's cumin, one teaspoon of kasuri methi, that's fenugreek. This is now infusing. I'm gonna pour it over the okay. right, Give her a quick stir and switch it off. 